Uh, thank you for the Dr. Bambang inviting me to be shared, to be greeting from the churches in Korea uh, this time. I am the General Secretary of Korean World Missions Association and uh, representing the, the Korean Church, all the mission agencies in Korea, including foreign mission agency and the domestic mission agency as well. Uh, the other one is uh, I am the head chairman of Asia Mission Association as well. So. I'd like a great blessing to the AEA, the 40th anniversary this time, and then AMA, and then AE, AEA, uh, we are serving for Asian mission movement for a new landscape. So we are looking for a uh, new landscape, new picture in Asia. Currently, we are facing remarkably rapid changes and the challenges to Christianity in Asia and around the globe. We are hearing news of a decline in a Western church, such as England and other European churches, France and North America, US as well. As you know that the church buildings are sold to Muslims, Hindus, and the Buddhist, some are turning into the bookstore, and some are into the in some in, into the bars in Europe and the U.S. The decline of Western churches is also causing causing many major changes in the global mission. On the other hand, though, we are looking for the Asian church. Asia faces a completely different situation, which are persecution and revival. We live in a very similar situation as the early church, which was persecuted by Roman Empire. In Asia, uh, it is not just a persecution. In the middle of a persecution, Asian churches are growing. We hear amazing news of revival from China, India, Indonesia, Iran, and even Pakistan. The Lord is accomplishing great things in Asia. It is the same with what the early church experienced revival under persecution. I believe that the Christianity is no longer a Western religion. The center of Christianity is no longer the West. The center of gravity of Christianity is not in the Northern Hemisphere anymore. The region where Christianity is growing most is Africa, Asia, and South America. The Global South Church has become the new center of the world Christianity. I recently, received a, I recently received a request from the European Church to send more Asian missionary, including Korean missionary, to Europe. The Asian churches should realize their duties and the roles in global mission as the emerging center of the world Christianity. How can the Asian church attend and achieve God's mission? Asian churches may not have the financial capabilities compared to the Western church. I mean, the, when the Western church send a missionary to the mission field and the project follow them and the money also follow them, the missionary from Global South cannot do that. So, therefore, Asian churches cannot use the same mission supporting system as the Western Church, which requires huge financial support. To overcome this barrier, the ASEAN Church should seek to be more firmly connected. I believe ASEAN Churches can complete God's mission by filling in each other's gaps through mutual understanding and cooperation. I believe this will be more beautiful in the eyes of the Lord and the closure to the biblical mission. The ASEAN has served the ASEAN churches 
with the evangelical movement uh, for the uh, 14 years. I bless AEA in my heart. I deeply appreciated AEA's huge contribution to ASEAN churches. Uh, with the great respect and appreciation to the AEA, AEA now I want to encourage AEA to take a step further toward the fulfillment of the Great Commission of our Christ. It is the spreading of the gospel to every corner of Asia and furthermore playing roles and the function of the Asian church for the global mission. So I hope that the AEA and the AMA cooperate for this mission. I want to add one more comment to ASEAN Church and the ASEAN Mission. As ASEAN Churches, we should take pride in our ASEAN Church and the ASEAN Missions. We are living in the era of globalization, which is manifest in the local movement. I, uh, recently, I, I read a newspaper that a K-pop song becomes the number one song on the billboard chart in the global market. But the, this song was sung in Korean and not in English. It means it is an era in which things traditionally considered local has developed in becoming the global standard. The ASEAN missions should be a mission for ASEAN people and the mission centered by ASEAN people. This new mission way will be a global standard in Asia. In the local area, the Asia missions can be the standard for global mission. If our Asian church develops a biblical mission model, it will be a great contribution and blessing to Asian and the global missions. So we all know that the Remember that the Jesus is an ASEAN. They remember that the birthplace of Christianity is Asia. Once again, congratulations on the AES, the 14th anniversary, and the holding of this conference. I hope the AEA plays a role in the missionary revival of the church in Asia. I bless AEA as it continues to play a valuable role in serving the ASEAN Church. And I envision this AEA conference to be an opportunity for Asian leaders to listen to God's voice together for his mission. Uh, throughout the conference, I believe, I believe that God will lead us in his unity and his mission. Congratulations once again, and may God bless you. Let's open AEN, everyone. Blessings. Thank you.